Why do cows have hooves instead of feet? Because they lack toes. <laughs> What's Beethoven's favorite fruit? Ba -da -da -da. <laughs> Hello Catholic Heart, my name is Logan Edwards, I'm from Prior Lake, Minnesota, and I'm really excited to be applying for Summer Staff 2020. We're outside my church, my home church, St. Michael's in Prior Lake. Let's take you inside and we'll show you why I would make a great staff member. So here we are uh, in my home parish, St. Michael's in Prior Lake. I am currently a first year student at St. John's University in Collegeville, Minnesota, where I am studying theology and psychology in hopes of becoming a youth minister in the next four years. Um, another part of my life that I'm very excited to begin. Um, but I think Catholic Heart could be a great beginning to get my foot in the door into that and, you know, really start to build the, the faith of children and kids around my age group um, and give back to an organization that has given me so much in my faith life. Um, I grew up, I was born and raised Catholic, had a, uh, my two parents, my younger brother, we came to church mostly whenever we could, um, but there was something lacking. I never, never had that real relationship with God, and that was until I had the opportunity to go on my first Catholic Heart trip my sophomore year uh, through St. Mike's. And um, it was there that I truly felt God's love for the first time, especially in adoration. Um, and it was then that I realized that God had something for me, a love for me that I didn't comprehend yet. And it just caused me to dig deeper and deeper into that. Um, and that is what has led me back to you guys, uh, just because I want to be able to give back to that organization that, that truly gave me the gift of a relationship with my father. Um, and so I see this as a great opportunity to give back to the organization and the kids that come to your camps in hopes of finding a relationship with God. So I just want to go into the reasons why I think I'd make a great staff member for you guys. So I understand it's a it's it's work camp. Um, we're gonna be there and we're gonna be working hard all summer. If I'm blessed enough to be able to work with you guys, I understand that it's gonna be late nights, early mornings, working to have these campers have the best experience they can, so they can experience God at their work sites, experience God with the program. Um, it's just gonna be a long summer. Um, but I think all the work that I've done in my life has really prepared me for work like this. Uh, I've been athletic my whole life, uh, playing football and wrestling, baseball all the way through. Um, I've developed that work ethic to where I understand that I have to put my self-comfort aside if I want to see others around me have the same success. Um, and I think that's going to be very important when it comes to working with these uh, students that come into the camps because uh, I want to make sure that they have the best experience they possibly can. I would say another strength that I could bring to the team that I'm fortunate enough to work with would be my strength in prayer life and my reliance on prayer and the sacraments. Um, I find my prayer life to be really important in how I live, um, especially when I'm very busy, especially with being a college athlete, balancing all that schoolwork with all the athletics. It's really important for me to find time to settle down and be with my Lord. Um, and Catholic Heart provides a great opportunity for that, especially with the daily Mass and adoration. Uh, those days, again, they're going to be very long, but my ability to sit with my Lord when I, when I might need Him the most, uh, I find very important. Uh, I'm a self-proclaimed mama's boy. I've devoted myself to Mary. I think that she's a great person to rely on when you need to be personal with Christ. Uh, praying through Mary is a great way to gain that intimacy with Him. Um, so I think my ability to rely on Mary and rely on the sacraments, the Eucharist, uh, would all be a great way for me to fit into a uh, work team for you guys. So another great thing that I could bring to a team, um, something that might be overlooked by a lot of people, is that sense of teamwork and unity that has to come when you're working on a team, especially with the same team for a whole summer. Um, I find that I've worked with people, whether it's in sports or my uh, previous jobs, 
where I worked landscaping. Um, I had to be able to work with others and hear their sides uh, so that we could come together and make a good product for our customer. Um, but it becomes really important to, to be willing to adapt to what other people are good at and you know really bring your strengths to the table as well as um, emphasize theirs and it can really make a team work well together. I would say another thing I'm really good at is taking direction. Again, working in landscaping, I was a, I was a low man on the totem pole. I worked with guys who were, who were professionals. This is what they did for their living. I was just a high school kid doing that for their summer job. So I learned uh, that I had to take guidance from others. And I think that could be really useful, especially as a first year coming on to uh, staff, I would be able to learn from the other people who had have had previous experience on camp and it would really help in that I would able, be able to learn from them to make myself a better staff member as well as bring uh, new insights to the team. So those are a few things that I think would make me a great team member for you guys in Catholic Heart, whether it's my hard work ethic or my ability to work as a team or my ability to take direction. Um, but at the end of the day, it's gonna be about serving others around us because as Catholics, we are called to be the hands and feet of Jesus Christ on earth today. Um, and Jesus Christ is all around us, so it's our duty to go and serve others and see the Christ in them. And I see Catholic Heart as a great opportunity to carry this out. Thank you for your time. Uh, thank you for considering me to be on your staff for the summer of 2020. I'll be praying for you guys through this process. Uh, I ask that you guys pray for me, that I may continue to grow in my faith so I may serve you well if I am lucky enough to serve with you guys this summer. Um, so God bless.